let's do some magic here, okay? Google up the helical model of the planetary movement around the sun. This is how the planets are actually revolving around the sun. And in Surah Yasin, Allah Azawajal says that the sun, Ashams, and everything around it is in a perfect motion, moving from wherever it was supposed to take birth towards wherever it's supposed to end. I want you to look closely to your fingerprints, the same spiral, okay? Now, everybody has a certain degree of a change in that spiral, and that degree of change is our identity. That's why no human beings, no two human beings have the same fingerprints. Now Google up the Kaaba. Now, this is the first thing Allah told Adam al Islam to do, right? Make this. Now, you do know as Muslims that there is another Kaaba right on top of this Kaaba. And there's a spiral between this Kaaba and the other Kaaba. That spiral is denoted by the tawaf that human beings do. The hadith that the day of judgment will not come until you see this tawaf coming to an halt. What I'm trying to get all of you guys here to think that it is all well connected with this certain singular center and everything revolving around it in a perfect perfect ratio and everything is being run by that system why i'm telling you all of this so that you can open your mathematical brain all the time when you look at anything that god created and connect it with a single center